Hi guys, I do want to start this video off saying I'm not saying having a disability or being disabled is like amazing. It definitely has its downs more than its ups. But I do want to put this video out here to say to anyone who has the disabilities I have or just any disabilities there is always a positive and into a negative or opposite way around as well there's always a negative in from a positive but we're gonna focus on the positives today I feel like I always talk about the negative of like oh I've got this and this is wrong and this is wrong but I never actually talk about what I'm glad of being disabled so we're gonna talk about that today there isn't many positives but i've written three down and i will say the three positives are big positive to me it's like part of my personality first one is i don't have to do night shifts now i know people normal people have a choice like you apply for that job if you don't want to do night shifts you don't do them but if someone recommends me like being like oh can you do a night shift tonight i can say no or i shouldn't be able to do night shift because i need my sleep because of my epilepsy that sleep or stress can make me have a seizure so i need my sleep so that's why i can't do night shift but also the reason why that's a positive because i like my sleep so <laughs> and also I don't do well at night like when it's pitch black and like I need to work I get too tired number two I have so much determination I find this with every person who is disabled in any way you are I find they have so much determination because they've been through so much and like my my main disability is cerebral palsy like that is a physical change i need to do things that are different so that's why i have the determination to do these things get a job go to college and i just find there's more determination in disabled people than non-disabled people i'm not saying to say non-disabled people don't have determination or work hard or like their work driven i'm not saying that but when you have someone that's keeping you back from doing what you want to do it does make you a bit more driven than someone who doesn't have the disability that you do have and the last and final one is i appreciate the little things because because of if nobody watching this has seen any of my other videos and this is the first one you clicked on i had a heart condition when i was born i had 13 holes in my heart and my main arteries were the wrong way around and um, because of that i also had a blip to the brain what caused a stroke what caused my epilepsy and my left side hemiplegia the type of cerebral palsy i have also i've got learning disabilities so i feel like because of all that and i know i've always got brought up someone's worse than you i know that sounds like a negative but it is for that worse person but i think of it as a positive because it puts in my mind like someone's not here today today's someone's last day Today someone has a trope and their worst their trope was worse than you. Today someone's in hospital. There's always someone worse than you. I'm not saying you can never have a negative day and be sad about being different or like having this disability that some days you wish you could just make go away. But when you've got that mindset of someone's worse than you, it makes you think or personally to me it makes me like appreciate the little things because it's like well I'm able to do this yes I need to do it in a different way 
but I'm able. Like someone's not able to do that today. Like someone's not even here today. It just makes you think a little bit more. Also, when I had a bleed to the brain and my heart sank, my parents always got told that I could have been worse, I could have been worse than I am, or like I wasn't going to be able to walk, wasn't able, gonna, wasn't able to like talk, and as you can see I'm talking not the best, but I'm talking. They thought I wasn't going to talk, they thought I was going to be in a wheelchair, they thought I wasn't going to walk, and I've proved them wrong. I've, I've done everything that they thought I couldn't do. And I keep on doing that. So that's why I appreciate the little things in life, even if it is like you lived another day or you got a new job or you're saving money. Like, you're able to do that. And just be grateful that you're able to do what you're doing today. I just want to put this video out here because I feel like I always talk about the negatives and I wanted to talk about the positives once so if you have any of the disabilities that I have or if you're just feeling down about the disability you have you are doing amazing you are determined to do this you will get through this and keep on thinking of the positives always think there's someone's worse than you because there is if you did like this video, give it a thumbs up and let me know in the comments what other types of videos you want to hear. If it is another like, talking about three more things that are positive about the disability. Or I can go in more deep and talk about the positives about having cerebral palsy, the positives of having learning, a learning disability. Like I said, there's not many, but I will try and think of some if you want that as a series. Let me know in the comments. And if you did like this video, give it a thumbs up. Bye.